Hi, this is Griffin Connor with First Updates Now, coming to you from the Chesapeake District Championships at George Mason University in uh, Fairfax, Virginia. Today, I'm here with 1727 Rex, and they're here to talk about their mechanisms on their robot, their uh, impeccable and looking electrical system, and their overall match strategy to have them right here at the number one seed so far. This video on First Updates Now is made possible by viewers like you and also the following sponsors. Kettering University is looking for talented robotic students who want to continue learning and innovating in a hands-on real-world experience format. Kettering University representatives will be at dozens of FIRST events this season, including the championship. Go to kettering.edu slash FIRST to see which events you can meet a Kettering University representative. FRC competition season is here. Submit your favorite moments to FRC Clips of the Week by each Sunday at discord.gg slash first updates now. Also, the FRC Top 25 poll is open Sunday 5 p.m. Eastern to Monday 5 p.m. Eastern, where you can vote for your top 25 teams of the week at firstupdatesnow.com slash FRC Top 25. So let's take a look at the mechanisms of the robot. How is it that you came about this specific design? Yeah, so uh, right when the game uh, came out, we uh, decided we wanted a really simple, robust, efficient robot. So uh, starting with our drivetrain, this is uh, 1727's first year with a swerve drive. So we are using the Rev Max Swerve system uh, with the L2 uh, 5.08 to 1 uh, gear reduction. Um, so this allows us to move around the field uh, really quickly and efficiently. Um, and then what we do is we have our arm um, with an elevator and an intake on the end. So this allows us to pick up from the floor really easily, as well as the single substation, where we th can then score on any level of the grid. So we can do a quick demonstration of uh, picking up and some of the subsystems on our robot. So uh, we'll start with uh, intaking down from the floor, and then uh, we can do extension, uh, and then we can just do a quick demonstration of intaking. So this is intaking a cone and outtaking and intaking a cube and outtaking. So uh, with this system, we can pick up from the floor, pick up from the uh, single substation, move around the field as quickly as we can, uh, and then score anywhere on the field. All right. And now if we look into the nitty gritty of the robot itself, it is such a clean electrical system. What all goes into keeping it clean and keeping it so pristine? So in terms of our electrical, what we've done is we've really laid out the design of our systems and ensure that each component of the electrical system has enough space on the panel itself. So here you see that all of our CAN wiring and all of our power wires are laid out nicely. We really love our 90 degree angles and we've just kept everything as secure and as compact as possible while still leaving enough space for all the components. And then also we've made a couple of upgrades this year. We've changed our battery wires from 6 gauge to 4 gauge just to minimize the amount of resistance going through the wire increasing the cross-sectional area and we've also ensured that all of our wires are as short as possible by mounting 10 of our 11 motors on our belly pan itself and then here you can also see one of our most um, one of the pieces of documentation we pride ourselves most in is our electrical system. Here you can see we created this detailed diagram of all of our wiring with all of the different gauges that we use as well as where everything routes. And this was actually done in PowerPoint. So a lot of hours spent there, but very worth it. All right. And so you guys are currently the number one seed after day two. What al or, and also given the fact that you've also been extremely extremely strong overall the entire season. What all has been going into your match strategies? What do you choose to do and what do you choose to prioritize? Yeah, so given the nature of this game, match strategy is something that we've really prioritized and getting fine-tuned here on the field and at home, just what the communications are and just getting clear communications between the drive team. And so one of the ways that we've done that is we've actually, we only have one driver for this entire robot this year. So Matthew here is our only driver. And then we now have two drive coaches. One drive coach helps the other teams, whereas uh, I am the other drive coach that just helps Matthew and just pays attention to our robot. So one thing that we found out is that we really, really need to nail what pieces we're getting and where at all times on the field. So filling out all those high links and then just getting wherever we need to fill in links from there. And that's something that we've really prioritized. So by doing so, what we've done is that we have me and I'm always just looking at the field and looking at the grid and just finding out wherever we need to place pieces. And I'm just yelling at teammates and uh, just finding out what they're doing and just juicing information out of them so that we know exactly what to do at all times. Uh, another big thing here is so 
as you said, we're ranked number one undefeated right now, and we've gotten four RPs in every match other than the one that we tied. But one thing that we've really tried to get is all of those links down whenever possible. So we've tried to always prioritize links. It doesn't really matter if they're high, mid, or low, but just getting links is always going to be the best idea. And then just getting clear communications while parking or climbing at the end of the match has been a very, very big uh, optimization point as well. Just getting information out of our teammates and then utilizing it effectively has been our strong point of the season. All right. Well, on behalf of First Updates Now, thank you guys so much for taking the time out of here, and good luck to you guys in the rest of the competition. This video on First Updates Now is made possible by viewers like you and also the following sponsors. Kettering University is looking for talented robotic students who want to continue learning and innovating in a hands-on real-world experience format. Kettering University representatives will be at dozens of FIRST events this season, including the championship. Go to kettering.edu slash FIRST to see which events you can meet a Kettering University representative. FRC competition season is here. Submit your favorite moments to FRC Clips of the Week by each Sunday at discord.gg slash FIRST updates now. Also, the FRC Top 25 poll is open Sunday, 5 p.m. Eastern to Monday, 5 p.m. Eastern, where you can vote for your top 25 teams of the week at firstupdatesnow.com slash FRC Top 25. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring the bell to stay up to date on our new videos. Keep the conversation going and provide your input to our content. Watch our live shows at twitch.tv forward slash firstupdatesnow. Join our Discord at discord.gg forward slash firstupdatesnow. And check out Fun FTC on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And First Updates Now on Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter.